Good afternoon, 47. Your destination is Marrakesh, Morocco. Your targets, Kong Tuo Quang, head of a Chinese construction conglomerate, and Mathieu Mendola, chief architect at Tuo Quang's biggest rival, Hamilton Lowe. Mendola plans to double-cross his employer and leak non-disclosable company documents to Tuo Quang, including the confidential offer for a multi-billion dollar real estate project. In response, Hamilton Lowe has requested that we eliminate both men and send their competition a clear message. Kong has rented a rooftop patio for the meeting, but the location is as of yet unclear. So track them and eliminate them, and reclaim the documents. Good luck, 47. Welcome to Marrakesh, 47. Mendola has just arrived. He is unaware of Kong's secret meeting location, but we know that Kong is hosting a lavish party at the Shisha Cafe, and we suspect the meeting will take place nearby. Good luck, 47. That is Mathieu Mendola. I caught the show as well, and I loved it. Her brick painting of the men in the underpants <gasps> made me Are you okay? so Can I get you from the bar? I have no okay. idea what you're Just talking let me know about. If you need well, you should. She's amazing. It's total deconstruction to a simplified self-awareness that is that is so poignant and interesting. I got her clock. Mm, I saw that. It was beautiful, raw but wonderful. I love Tom. Ugh, time for another drink. Uh, uh, no sex for you tonight, mister. Oh, honey, unless he buys you one of her paintings. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. Well, I was actually there at the opening. She was really nice and intelligent, and I don't think she's interested in selling to people like us. Um, ex like us? Do you need anything? What do you Nothing. mean? We have, have money. Evening. But no concept of buying art. We buy and sell like it's the latest fad, or, as I would say, changing underwear. We are not collectors. We're consumers. Oh. Do you hey, how you have doing, any sir? idea how much I hate you right now? Mm. I'm just saying, my dear, the dollar isn't everything. Should we keep doing this? What do you mean? This is not working. Sure it is. We're here. That's not what I'm saying. Look, look, I love that you've invited me here, but you and me, it's not working. I think it is. You always say that, but it's not. I feel like I'm doing all the giving, and all you do is take and not give anything back. Good evening. You feel that way? How yes, is everything? I do. Can I get that anything from the unfair. bar? unfair. Have a lovely evening. Always my fault. God, you are so self-righteous. I'm confused at the moment. There's so much stress. What should I say? Tell me you love me. You... you know I can't say that. You're a dick. But I just okay? don't say that. Can I get I you anything from the, the bar? But okay. do you well, love me? Well, please let me know if you need anything. I, I don't know. Enjoy your Yes. Evening. You're pressuring me. So, you do? Yes. I love you. I love you more than anything. Oh, what the hell is he? Well, I love you be, too. I told he would be I here. I just wanted to hear you say it. Is everything okay? Can I get you anything? Oh, good oh, to I say it. I love you. Well, please don't hesitate. Yeah. Don't know if you your mind. It's nice to say that. <laughs> and it makes you so much sexier. I love you. <sighs> Don't try too hard. Huh. Sure looks like they're having a party behind there. Uh, I, I think it's invite only. Ah, damn it. Can't drink any more coffee. I want booze. You always want booze. Look, your hands are shaking. What? That's the coffee. It's really strong. So I want an invite. How do we do it? I don't think they're gonna let people like us in. We can go back to the hotel. Good evening. Rob the mini bar. Let's, the bar. No, let's just sit fine. here for a okay. bit. Well, please let me know if you need anything. I'm not an alcoholic, you know. 
I never said you were. Come on. We'll get you drunk tonight. Don't worry. We're on holiday. Woo! <laughs> Damn straight, lover. <laughs> Don't push your luck. Hello, sir. How can I help you? You should try our local coffee. It's delicious. Or a latte? No, no thanks. I've just been stood up. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Sure. Uh, look, I need to find a phone booth. Of course, sir. If you just walk outside again, there should be one just on the left. All right, thanks. Is everything okay? Can I get you anything? No, thanks. Have a lovely evening. Why are all the people hey, stay safe. Okay. You know what? The municipality should do something about okay this. Here. We pay our taxes, right? You want to know why? Those politicians. A lot of those guys are selling used mobile phones overseas. So why would they want to kill their own business? It makes sense. Oh, that's nonsense. I don't believe that. Well, believe what you want, brother. But I have my sources, and they are top-notch. Oh, oh, all right, sources? There? The same sources that said the mayor's a secret cross-dresser? Oh yeah, those are good sources. Listen, if all the phones are broken, the only thing that makes sense is that somebody somewhere is getting paid. That's the only logical reason. And and you know what? Answer me this. Why would the mayor buy lady shoes in size 13 and a half? You can ask anybody at the market. His wife is tiny. Ah, just forget I asked. Shoes. <laughs> I just want to make a call, okay? Fine, good. Hope you trust me next time. Hey, uh, where's Boyle? Yeah, probably doing what he usually does. What? Looking at carpets? What, what is it with him and souvenirs? Uh, did he give you the key to the back door of the Shisha Cafe? Ah, oh, crap, he forgot. It, why is he always looking for carpets? I don't know. Probably his wife, you know? She wants a carpet. He's on duty. He doesn't have time to look for carpets. Then go and tell him. Yeah, I will. It, it's just unprofessional, you know? According to the note, one of the guards has gone carpet shopping. He will most likely be alone, and the key he bears could be of good use. Uh, sir? So my sister met this customer who really stood out. Hey, why can't I date your sister? She's gorgeous. Because it's my sister. Now, she told me something odd. She said a Frenchman came to her shop at the airport and asked for a fortune teller. Yeah, yeah, Frenchman in an airport. Real odd. No, you don't get it. See, I took my grandmother to a fortune teller the other day, and the fortune teller said a Frenchman would come to Marrakesh and ask for a fortune teller. Apparently, Mendola is looking for a fortune teller. Sounds promising. A man of superstition surrenders himself to fate. Well, you don't have to be clairvoyant to see his future. Tourist asking for a fortune teller. Well, whoop de doo What did she say then? <sighs> Nothing. But I feel like it's all part of some grand design. And the message was not to her, but to me to tell you that a Frenchman is looking for a fortune teller. Look, I... <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Now... Can I date your sister? Uh, let me think. No. Eh, I don't blame you. Probably for the best. Hello! Stand aside. I'm telling. You want a lamp? These are dark times, no? Let in some light, I think. I don't even fix that light. Yeah, it's so annoying. I think you predicted the lights are going to hell and then maybe go and reset them or shut them off or something. No. Who are you? Why are you here? I see death is, is all around you. You should leave! Now! Oh, you're 
quite tall and handsome. said I was, <laughs> well, things would have to happen. People would have to be dealt with, and I'd rather that not happen. So, is there any way you can tell me who knows my real identity so I don't have to kill them? You are going to die. Now leave before you kill us both. Good thinking, 47. It's time to read Mendola his misfortune. Pardon the pun. I need to know something very important. You're not a fraud. Hi. Are you curious? You see, I, I have this meeting in a few minutes. And it really is important. Can you give me an idea of the outcome? You are a fortune teller, right? I am. And I see a man. A Chinese man. He is waiting for you on a rooftop. Will the meeting be a success? I also see... Death. idea of a joke. Oh, you are good. All right. All right, thanks. I'll be on my way. Goodbye. What the... Target down. Two objectives remaining. Documents acquired. One objective remaining. good you know tourists they'll uh, they'll buy anything but but today we got a special customer yeah Thanks, he's rented the whole showroom on the top floor for just himself and he paid in dollars sounds like that is someone very rich I don't know I mean he's, he's a guy in a suit very serious you know too serious to be you know to be too rich uh, who cares he's paid and enough for a month's rent haha <laughs> true sounds like it's a good deal Happy for you. I'm sorry, <laughs> so sir. Are we. Tonight we have a private showing, so the shop is closed. But please come back tomorrow.
Huh. found the imperfect stitch. See, this is what separates man from the divine. It's a tradition. All carpets have them. Oh, really? Okay, okay. Well, in that case, I'll take it. Oh, no, no need to be hasty. Buying a Persian rug is a soul-searching experience. Take your Lovely day. My bad. Sir. Uh, don't Say the word. Nice work, 47. You now have backstage access to Kong's party. this how can I fix that look at that I can't fix this damn I'm good
Now head towards an exit. Central, area is clear. Please advise. Over. 